What's going on YouTube? Jessica here. Um, this is going to be my first tutorial on how to paint bathroom cabinets. Um, <clears throat> this bathroom actually has like an olive green color. I'm not too sure about it yet. I haven't decided if I'm going to keep it or not. But I do have some colors that I'm interested in painting this cabinet, um, haven't quite decided, but I will here in a few minutes. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is take out the hardware and remove the doors and the and take out the drawers. And I got my drill there to do that. And um, then I'll go ahead and uh, be back here in a minute. Okay guys, as you can see, I um, removed the drawers and the doors. This is a really old cabinet, but we just want to make it look nice on the outside. Um, there's the doors. There's the screws. And there's the drawers over there. Um, so what we want to do is get a damp rag and clean off all the doors and all this wood that we're going to be painting. Um, this is a product that I use um, from Healthy Home Company. It's called Clean. And since I have kids, um, I use this all over the house. It's actually um, a 10-in-1 cleaner. And it cleans up very well. And it's toxic free. Now I feel like I'm promoting this uh, this brand. Um, this is a wonderful brand actually. If you guys are interested in it, let me know. Um, anyways, I'm going to clean this off. I went ahead and um, put it in a spray bottle. And you only got to use about two squirts in there. And then, you know, start wiping this down. And I'll see you guys back here in a minute. Okay, now we have our supplies. Paint, paintbrush, calcium carbonate, and my bucket with a tablespoon of water. So as you can see, I already stirred my paint. This is the color we're going to be using. It's called Gray Morning by Bear. It's a very pretty color. Probably can't tell, but it's pretty awesome. So anyways, um, we're going to go ahead and stir it up. Um, I don't really have an exact ratio so pay attention so that's about I should try to pour about a cup that might be a little bit more than a cup and then calcium carbonate, about, about half a cup, maybe a little less, whatever floats your boat, stir it up. Get rid of those chunks, that's why I always put a little bit of water in there, put about a tablespoon of water. And it's going to thicken up just a little bit. And I'll be back. Okay, guys. We are back. We have stirred our paint up. And I have two brushes here. The wood stir brush. Very nice brush. And I found it at a garage sale, brand new. For two dollars and then I got a little Harbor Freight brush you can also use um, chip brushes if you want it doesn't really matter what kind of brush you use I got a smaller one for the smaller areas and a larger one for the larger areas I'm gonna go ahead and do the outline first and then go back and do the drawers and the um, doors so what we're going to do is get a little paint 
and I lay down a trash bag. Probably gonna take some pictures once this video is over because my phone doesn't have the best lighting and my camera wasn't working right now. So one thing about chalk paint is <clears throat> a lot of the times you only have to do one coat. What I usually do is do one thin coat and then another thin coat on top of that in areas where it'll need it. So this drawer doesn't come out, so we're just going to go ahead and paint through it. And I'll be back.